The start of a new semester there, but students were greeted with what seems like the same old song. Well, just hours after students checked into their dorms, the school sent out a campus alert about a student robbed at gunpoint on campus. Police say that, they, that he was walking alone after midnight on Elkhorn Avenue. That's when two men pulled up in a green Ford Explorer, pointed a gun, and robbed him. To new sides, Ann McNamara has been on campus all day talking to students. So what do they think of this first robbery of the school year? Well, Vina, they're very worried, as you can imagine. I know you were here just yesterday watching students move in in preparation for today's first classes. But before they ever got to those classes, they heard about their first robbery. Pink Converse. I have a bright personality. Air Jordans. It's all about the name brand. Nikes. They'll change colors. That aren't even out yet. In college, these things matter. That's just like taking my pride, you know? Somebody takes my shoes, they're taking my pride away from me. But for one Old Dominion student, his shoes may have saved his life. Any time a student, an Old Dominion University student, is in harm's way, it is a concern to this university. Just after midnight, a student walking on campus held at gunpoint by two men in a Ford Explorer. Robbing itself is really stooping to the ground level. And that's exactly how low the gunman went, asking for the one thing everyone wears outside. It took about a few months to, uh, for them to customize it and make it. Boat shoes. <laughs> My mom bought them for me. They're brown pumas. I just thought they were cute. Some students say at this point, no crime is surprising. I really think they would probably try to do that, like just take somebody's flip-flops or something. You think it's that bad here? I think it can be. And as the university increases police patrols in the area, they're urging students to walk in groups. We take it seriously. It is not something to be tolerated. And we're going to make sure and do everything we can. 49th and Elkhorn, this is the intersection. And ODU tells me that there will be extra police patrolling this area tonight. They also say that they've spent $2 million extra dollars on security, both on lighting and on police enforcement and on security cameras. And they say police are checking if this crime was caught on one of those cameras. Reporting at ODU, I'm Ann McNamara, 10 on your side.